this tutorial, I'm going to discuss how to use R to calculate quantiles from a normal distribution. To begin, let's consider the standard normal distribution. So we know that the standard normal distribution is centered around 0 with standard deviation 1. And to calculate a quantile from that, we're looking for the z value that defines a certain lower tail area under this curve. For example, we might be looking for the 0.25 quantile, which tells us that we're looking for a z value that separates the lower 0.25 from the upper 0.75. Now to find this in R, we're going to use the Q norm function here. So this is easy to remember because Q stands for quantile. And what we need to do is give it the probability, the lower tail probability that we're looking for. So that's negative, or not negative, 0.25. And then we know that we're working with a standard normal distribution, which would mean zero and standard deviation one. And that's how we find our quantile. So let's go to R and calculate this. So we use Q norm. And we're looking for the 0.25 quantile from a standard normal distribution. So we find this to be negative 0.67 or so. But we're not always interested in a standard normal distribution. Sometimes we're interested in an arbitrary normal distribution. For example, we might be interested in a normal distribution centered around 100 with standard deviation uh, of 6, which would make, mean that we have variance of 6 squared or 36. And now, suppose that we're looking for the 96th quantile of this distribution. So we know that we're centered at 100. And the 96th quantile is this value of z that separates the lowest 0.96 of that distribution from the upper tail area of 0 0.04. But R only knows how to deal with these lower tail areas. So we're thinking about this 0.96. And again, we use the Q norm function in R. So this time, we'll use Q norm. We're looking for the 0.96 quantile. We have a mean of 100 and a standard deviation of 6. And we find that the 96th percentile, or the 0.96 quantile, is 110.5 for this distribution. 